a Geeks Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today showing you 12 different ways to open File Explorer in Windows 10, plus a little mixing and matching with shortcuts. Let me show you. Odds are, if you're watching the video, you use File Explorer frequently. Maybe it won't open for you. You can try a different method, or maybe you'll find something new that you didn't know about that you can use. So let's start with the obvious when you install Windows 10. File Explorer is right here. It's probably the most common place people access it from. So you just click it and go. The next one is almost two steps in one, and it's both done from the start menu. We're going to do a shortcut, and we're going to open it. So let's go ahead and click start. Scroll way down here to Windows System. Click on it to expand it, and there's File Explorer. Click on it to launch it, or right-click, pin to start. Let's do that. And, of course, you can always right-click that to unpin it, or you can do it from where you just did it here. Click on more and you can pin or unpin from taskbar. So if you don't want it down there, I gotta admit that's where I that's my go-to. So I'm gonna leave it there. And that's kind of as I said, two for one. Okay, let's go to explorer.exe. All else fails. Open file explorer, which is kind of funny when you think about it, because it's yeah. Um, but what you can do from here again sort of what you just saw obviously you can run it from here but it doesn't do you much good because well you're already in explorer let's get down to explorer it's right here but the more important thing is another place where you can right click run it as administrator pin it to start as we just did and pin it to taskbar easy enough another neat spot about this one which i like is you can drag and drop it or copy it now Let's see here, that didn't work. You can right click on your desktop and paste or paste shortcut. Which obviously from here you can kind of move it around to other places as well. All right, let's get rid of that. Where are we at? Keyboard shortcut. Grab your fingers there and press the Windows key plus E. Ready? That's a good one right there too. I like that. Windows search, just start typing whether you use Windows key plus S or if you talk to Cortana, you can say it, open File Explorer, or just start typing File Explorer until you see it right there. So that takes care of the keyboard shortcut. That takes care of Windows search. The power user menu, sometimes forgotten, Windows key plus X, and it's right here. The power menu, by the way, is very handy. Apps and features. Windows key plus X is a good one to know if you didn't. File Explorer. So, we got that. Let's see here. Oh, the good old run. I like that. So, once again, Windows key plus R. And type Explorer. And press Enter or click OK. There it is. Cortana, we just mentioned that. Make sure you just say Open File Explorer. Cortana should respond. I'll Open File Explorer and, yeah, Open File Explorer. PowerShell. Same thing, that word Explorer comes in handy. We're going to jump and take care of both PowerShell and Command Prompt in the same one. So we're going to, let's say Windows Key Plus X. That's how I like to get to PowerShell. You shouldn't have to run as admin, but I do as default and type E-X-P-L-O-R-E-R. -E there it is. And it's same with command prompt. I will not run as admin this time. Just to say we did. There it is. Task manager. Kind of getting out of your out of your way a little bit here, but hey, it works. Click on File, Run New Task once you have Task Manager open. So let's see. Here's a couple ways to get there. I am uh, I have a habit. Let's see if I can get it to work. Control-Alt-Delete Task Manager. It's just, I don't know. Don't ask me why. That's always how I get to Task Manager. Old school, you know. So as you can see, we have to click on File, Run New Task. And again, this is probably mostly handy if you just happen to be in Task Manager. But it's one more way. And again, E-X-P-L-O-R-E-R. -E -R. And who knows, there might be other ways, but I think 12 of them ought to cover you. 
And there you go. So there are 12 different ways which you can open File Explorer in Windows 10. Hopefully we remind you of something you forgot about or maybe you saw something you didn't know before. I'm always learning myself. In the bottom right hand corner over here, Major Geeks logo, click that, click subscribe. You can find our social media buttons here on the page. Just look for the video description for a link to the page if you'd like to follow along with the tutorial or I will have the video embedded right here by the time you see it and you can both follow along with the pictures and the video from this page. I'll throw a link up to up here. You'll see it with a little eye up here if you want to come over and visit the page. We always appreciate that. Thanks for watching as always. See ya.